Hi everyone and welcome back. Welcome to my YouTube channel and I am Tarun Sharma and this playlist is only about T3 stack. We have already covered uh, initial three videos. So three videos we have already covered and we have already discussed what is T3 stack. In the last video we talked about okay how we can create a simple T3 app and uh, we used uh, next auth for authentication and there we used a Google and we were using trpc trpc for the api handler right now what is the end goal of this particular playlist that also we can talk about because t3 stack is a combination of all these technologies prisma and uh, we will focus on these things trpc prisma and typescript okay typescript is same we are writing everywhere and then next is yes 13.x we are targeting okay so what is our end goal end goal is to build a twitter clone that is the the final goal you can say i will just tag it this is our final goal of this whole playlist okay so the important part here is uh final uh we are going to build a twitter clone that is the final goal but before that we need to understand these concepts individually well, like how the prisma works that's a typescript ORM then we can build a small application uh, with express and trpc and next js 13 we are going to we will be integrating uh, with all these things with the next js so how what all different apps you can expect from here so we have a next js with prisma and that is purely api based because we are going to create apis in Next.js, we are not going to use a trpc here that gives us an overview how to use next.js with the prisma then we can just create another combination let's say next.js with uh, uh, trpc and prisma so here the api routes are going to call this trpc handler and that those api router is going to use the prisma for it so, I mean, at the end, you need to fetch the data. So, API routes are going to use TRPC handler, right? And these TRPC handlers are going to get the data from Prisma. Okay, with that also, we can add, uh, let's say there is another application I want to build. There, we can just add a next auth also for the authentication and session management, right? So, all those things we are going to discuss individually first and then we are going to build because t3 stack if you just go and try to build an application it's very easy but people don't understand how prisma migrations and all these concepts really works let's say if you want to build an independent trpc server then how to build it we can build it by adding a just express server and uh, pass the trpc router with the express instance then typescript we are already using next js 13.0 here we will just add a next auth also next auth for authentication and we have already discussed about it we can use a google authentication twitter facebook and all and we will build an end-to-end -end application so this is the next step because in the previous video we just talked about a t3 react app t3 create app which is just a bare bones skeleton coming everything is just uh, summarized into one boilerplate but first we will discuss individually and then we'll build a small small nice and end-to-end -end single video application okay so that contains so that the react next js with the next auth and we'll add a prisma flavor and then trpc flavor and then finally once you have a good understanding on t3 stack components not t3 stack t3 stack is just a combination of these technologies we can just play with them individually once you are good then we will build a t3 clone a twitter clone at the end of uh, this playlist that is my primary goal i'm already covering airbnb clone with the with the same stack of technologies I will be using there a Next.js, Prisma and not TRPC, TRPC is not necessary to use. We can just use a Next.js API routes and next auth and Next.js 13.x. Okay, so stay tuned. This is uh, this is the just an introductory. And now the next video, I'm going to build a baseline. So we need to baseline our repository with the monorepo and PNPM and NX. So what we are going to do is because we, i'm going to build a multiple application so i always use this approach of creating a monorepo there we are going to have applications so i'm going to use a pnpm workspace these are the applications and the packages 
some packages we can also build if we can find some reusable code okay and then this is all pnpm workspace and nx is the monorepo tool pnpm workspace in my almost every tutorial i'm using pnpm uh, workspace and nx monorepo tool okay so that's the next part and after that we'll build a small small nice and clean uh, applications using nextjs and all these uh, modern stack 